Did you know that coffee is the second most traded commodity in the world? Unbelievable, isn't it? Today, we're diving into the intricate universe of coffee, from its humble origins to its iconic status in pop culture. We'll be revealing 10 amazing facts about this beloved beverage that has captured the hearts and taste buds of countless people across the globe. In the next 10 minutes, you will journey through the rich history, the cultural significance, and the economic impact of coffee. We'll explore the health benefits and risks, the biggest consumers, and the future of coffee. We'll even pit coffee against tea in a friendly matchup. Coffee is much more than a morning pick-me-up. It's a cornerstone of economies, a catalyst for social interactions, and a canvas for artistic expressions. So buckle up and prepare to delve into the fascinating world of coffee. Stay tuned, and let's get brewing. Embarking on our journey, fact number 10, the origin of coffee. Legend has it that our infatuation with coffee started with a curious Ethiopian goat herder. The story goes that he noticed his goats were unusually energetic after consuming berries from a certain tree. Intrigued, he tried the berries himself and felt the same invigorating effect. This discovery quickly spread across the region. However, it wasn't until these beans reached the Arabian Peninsula that they began their journey to becoming the beverage we cherish today. Here, coffee was first roasted and brewed, somewhat similar to how we prepare it now. The Arabian people were so enchanted by this powerful new drink that they kept it as their own guarded secret for many years. But as with all great secrets, the beans eventually found their way out. And the rest, as they say, is history. So, the beloved coffee has an interesting origin story. Moving on to fact number 9, the birth of coffee houses. As the aroma of coffee began to waft through the Middle East and Europe, it found a home in coffee houses. These weren't just places to grab a quick cup of joe and go, they acted as vibrant social hubs where people came to talk, exchange ideas, play games, and even listen to music. In the bustling bazaars of Istanbul and the winding streets of Venice, coffee houses were the beating heart of the city. They were the places where merchants discussed trade, travelers shared tales of distant lands, and scholars debated on ideas that shaped the world as we know it. From the Ottoman Empire's Cave Canes to London's 17th century coffee houses dubbed Penny Universities, these establishments were more than just about coffee. They were about community, conversation, and connection. So next time you step into your favorite cafe, remember, you're partaking in a centuries-old tradition. Coffee houses, not just a modern trend, but a centuries-old tradition. Scene script. Fact number eight, coffee and health. Coffee, that steaming cup of morning magic, holds a complex relationship with our health. On the one hand, coffee is rich in antioxidants, those powerful little compounds that help battle inflammation and bolster your immune system. It also contains essential nutrients such as riboflavin and pantothenic acid, and is known for its potential in reducing the risk of stroke and certain types of cancer. But like all magic potions, coffee comes with its caveats. High consumption can lead to an increase in heart rate, anxiety, and may disrupt sleep. It's also worth noting that adding sugar and cream can turn this healthful drink into a calorie bomb. So, what's the bottom line? Moderation is key. Enjoy your cup of joe, but remember too much of a good thing can be harmful. Clearly, coffee has a complex relationship with our health. Fact number seven takes us to the production of coffee. The world's coffee supply is primarily cultivated in a region known as the coffee belt, which spans the globe along the equator. From the volcanic slopes of Central and South America to the ancient birthplace of coffee in Africa and the tropical islands of the Pacific, these regions form the backbone of global coffee production. Brazil leads the pack as the largest coffee producer, contributing a third of the world's total coffee. It's followed by Vietnam, which specializes in robusta beans, and Colombia, known for its high-quality Arabica. These countries, along with others such as Ethiopia and Honduras, play a vital role in the global economy. Their farmlands are a hive of activity, where millions of workers toil away to harvest the beans that fuel our daily grind. Without these countries, our mornings might look a lot different. Fact number six, who are the biggest consumers of coffee? Let's take a trip around the world and see where coffee is most adored. Finland takes the top spot, with each person consuming, on average, more than three cups of coffee daily. Now that's a nation fueled by caffeine. The Scandinavian countries follow closely, with Norway, Iceland, and Denmark all making the top five. But what about the United States, the land of Starbucks and Dunkin' Donuts? Surprisingly, the USA doesn't even break the top 10, landing at number 26. It seems Americans prefer their coffee on the go, rather than a constant drip. 
Over in Asia, coffee consumption is rising rapidly, especially in South Korea and China, where the coffee culture is booming. Interestingly, Italy, the birthplace of espresso, lands at number 13. But then again, when your coffee is that strong, who needs quantity? It seems coffee is a universal love. A fact number five, coffee or tea? A question that has sparked countless debates around the globe. It's the clash of the titans in beverage form. On one hand, we have coffee, the dark and robust drink that powers many of our mornings. On the other, tea, a soothing elixir steeped in tradition and tranquility. From the bustling streets of New York to the serene tea gardens of Japan, the preference varies widely. While Americans might lean towards a strong cup of joe to kickstart their day, the British are renowned for their afternoon tea rituals. In China, tea is deeply embedded in their culture, while Italians can't imagine a day without espresso. The global preference is a tug of war. According to the International Coffee Organization, about 2 billion cups of coffee are consumed daily worldwide. On the flip side, the Tea Association of the USA reports that tea is the most widely consumed beverage globally after water. Despite their differences, both beverages hold a special place in our hearts. Fact number four, what is the environmental impact of coffee? The answer is as complex as the coffee bean itself. Coffee cultivation, while essential to our daily routines, has significant environmental implications. Every cup of coffee begins its journey in lush tropical regions where coffee plants thrive. However, to meet the global demand for this beloved beverage, large swaths of rainforest are often cleared for coffee plantations. This mass deforestation not only contributes to climate change, but also disturbs delicate ecosystems and threatens biodiversity. Moreover, the process of growing coffee requires copious amounts of water, a resource that's becoming increasingly scarce in many parts of the world. And let's not forget about the chemical fertilizers and pesticides frequently used in coffee farming, which can seep into the soil and waterways, causing pollution and harm to wildlife. Coffee, once a symbol of pleasure and productivity, now presents a stark environmental challenge. It's a sobering thought as we sip our morning brew. Coffee, a pleasure for us, but a challenge for our planet. Fact number three, the different types of coffee beans. Now let's dive into the world of coffee beans, the heart and soul of every brew. There are primarily four types of coffee beans that you should know about, Arabica, Robusta, Liberica, and Excelsa. Arabica beans, considered the gold standard in the coffee world, are known for their sweet, delicate flavor and complex acidity. On the other hand, Robusta beans pack a punch with their strong, bitter taste and high caffeine content. Then we have the Liberica beans offering a unique woody and smoky flavor profile that's truly one of a kind. Lastly, the Excelsa beans, though technically a variant of Liberica, are recognized for their tart and fruity notes, providing a refreshing twist to traditional coffee tastes. Each type of bean has its own distinct flavor and characteristics, creating a vibrant spectrum of taste experiences for coffee enthusiasts worldwide. From Arabica to Robusta, each bean contributes to the diversity of coffee flavors. Scene script, fact number two, coffee in pop culture. The influence of coffee on popular culture is undeniable. Movies and television shows often depict characters with a cup of joe in hand, symbolizing a moment of relaxation, a break from the chaos, or even a prop in a heated dialogue. From the iconic Friends Coffee Shop hangouts to the Twin Peaks obsession with a damn fine cup of coffee, the beverage has left its mark on the silver screen. In music, coffee has also found its rhythm. It's been the subject of catchy tunes from Bob Dylan's One More Cup of Coffee to Ella Fitzgerald's Black Coffee. It's a muse that's crossed genres and decades. Even literature isn't immune to coffee's influence. Countless authors have penned their masterpieces with a steaming mug by their side, often weaving coffee into their narratives. So, from your favorite sitcom to that novel you couldn't put down, remember, coffee isn't just a beverage, it's a cultural icon. Coffee, a supporting actor in our favorite media. Finally, fact number one, the future of coffee. As we peer into the crystal ball, it's clear that the coffee industry is bracing for change. Climate change is a real and pressing concern, with rising temperatures threatening the growth of our beloved beans. But it's not all doom and gloom. Innovations in farming practices and technologies are paving the way for a resilient future. We're seeing a shift towards sustainability, with more and more farms adopting organic and fair trade practices. The rise of plant-based milks is also changing the way we enjoy our lattes and cappuccinos, catering to a more health-conscious and environmentally aware consumer base. 
the world of coffee is also expanding beyond the cup. Coffee-infused products, from skincare to baked goods, are increasingly popular, heralding a new era of coffee consumption. And let's not forget about the continued rise of specialty coffee, with consumers craving a more personalized and high-quality experience. The future of coffee, uncertain yet promising. So there you have it, 10 fascinating facts about coffee. We've journeyed from its humble origins in Ethiopia, through the bustling coffee houses of the Middle East and Europe, to its place in our kitchens and cafes today. We've explored the impact coffee has on our health and on the environment, and how it compares to its rival, tea. We dove into the intricacies of coffee production, from the types of beans to the countries that consume the most. We've seen how coffee has permeated pop culture, from films to music to literature, and we've peered into the future, envisioning the role coffee might play in our lives in the years to come. Each of these facts tells a part of the coffee story, but there are countless more waiting to be discovered. So keep your curiosity brewing, and who knows what you might uncover. Remember, every cup of coffee has a story. Until next time, keep exploring.